Hey guys, Scully here with GoatFormat.com's card of the week. This week's card is Dark Mimic Level 1. Dark Mimic Level 1 is a flip effect monster that when it's flip face up lets you draw one card from your deck and then during your standby phase you can set it to the graveyard to special summon a Dark Mimic Level 3 from your hand or deck. It is a 1 star Dark Fiend type monster. So the reason that we're going to play Dark Mimic Level 1 in GOAT format is because it combos with Metamorphosis to summon Thousand Eyes Restrict and Tsukiyomi to let you draw multiple cards. A card you will generally see played instead of Dark Mimic Level 1 is Magical Merchant. Um, some reasons that you're going to want to play Dark Mimic Level 1 instead of Magical Merchant is because of some of the downsides of Magical Merchant. Both cards are generally good to set on your first turn. Um, but then when they flip face up, Magical Merchant makes you mill cards from your deck until you get to a Magic or Trap card. And you then reveal that card to your opponent and add it to your hand. Any of the monsters are going to go to the graveyard. So if you mill Blackluster Soldier early in the game, then your opponent's going to know for the remainder of the duel, you will most likely not be summoning Blackluster Soldier. And they're also going to be knowing whatever spell, set, spell or trap card is added to your hand, they'll be able to prepare for it. Dark Mimic level 1 has the benefit of having a 1,000 defense compared to Magical Merchant 700 so that it can survive a Sangin attack and allow you to combo it in the previous in the next turns with Tsukiyomi or with a Tribute Monster or Metamorphosis. It also does not reveal the card that you draw off of its effect. Another card you might see played instead of Dark Mimic level 1 is Dokochi the Battle Chanted Locomotive. Both monsters are dark, both monsters let you draw one card from your deck. Um, the difference being Dokochi is not going to be comboing with Metamorphosis. They will both still be able to combo with Tsukiyomi. Dokochi also has 1400 attack so it can put some pressure on the opponent. Whereas Dark Mimic level 1's 100 attack, the most you're probably going to be able to do with that is um, destroy a scapegoat token. So the decks that you're going to want to play Dark Mimic Level 1 over Magical Merchant is going to be any deck that you're running Thunder Dragon. Magical Merchant is great because it's a light monster. So if you're playing a deck with Thunder Dragon, you're going to have your light monsters pretty much covered. Um, the other thing is playing Magical Merchant and Thunder Dragon in the same deck could lead to milling a Thunder Dragon off of the Magical Merchant's effect. And then when you draw the Thunder Dragon, um, you'll only be able to add one copy to your hand instead of the two, kind of defeating the purpose of playing Thunder Dragon at all. So that's going to be one of the decks where Dark Mimic Level 1 uh, shines over Magical Merchant. Uh, so the other effect of Dark Mimic Level 1 that allows you to special summon a Dark Mimic Level 3 from your hand or deck uh, most decks were probably not going to be running Dark Mimic Level 3, but in Go format, you can do what's called Fail to Find. So even if you know you don't play Dark Mimic Level 3 in your deck at all, um, during your standby phase, say you have a Thunder Dragon or a different Light Monster already in your graveyard, but you don't have a Dark, but you have a Chaos Sorcerer or a Black Luster Soldier in your hand, um, you can send Dark Mimic Level 1 to the graveyard and then attempt to special summon a Dark Mimic Level 1 from your hand or deck. So even though you don't have one, you could use this effect. It'll put the Dark Mimic Level 1 into your graveyard and allowing you to have the light in the dark for your uh, Chaos Sorcerer or your Black Luster Soldier. This here is a sample deck from Format Library. Um, so you see here it runs Dark Mimic Level 1s, Thunder Dragons, Tsukiyomi, Metamorphosis. It allows you to play all these cards and the extra chaos monsters. So this is primarily the deck that you're going to want to be playing Dark Mimic Level 1. Really any deck where you need more level 1 monsters, lights aren't an issue, but um, you want to be able to have extra darks for your chaos sorcerer, then uh, and your metamorphosis. Dark Mimic Level 1, he's going to be your guy. So uh, thanks everybody. Remember to check out goatformat.com. Bye.